okay so in this video I'm gonna show you a guide on how to run custom res for Apex since uh, you can't do that in a gaming laptop because in Nvidia control panel you don't have display settings so your next next best option would be Intel graphics control panel so what you wanna do is you press control alt 12 or just type in Intel graphics control panel and I get it right here go to display custom res yes and you type in the custom res that you want right here no. 1080 and the refresh rate of your monitor and you add it since I already have it I'm not gonna add it and then once you do that it will be right here so now what you wanna do is you go to your search bar saved games respawn apex local and video config before you do any uh, changes to the text document I'm going to go to properties and unselect read only apply then ok so now you go here and you see the res option right here it says default res default res height so you want to change this to 1440 and 1080 so now what you do is you press ctrl s close and then you go properties read only apply then ok and then the second last step it would be to go to steam library properties and you add this uh, command right here I'll leave this command in the description of the video so you just add it to your option, uh, launch options so now you just run apex now once you're in Apex you have to do one last step and this is like a crucial step you need to do this all the time once you're in game what you have to do is you have to press alt enter when you're in the <laughs> menu right here and you have to do this every time you launch Apex I'm pretty sure so what this does it makes your game from win uh, from full screen to window and from window to full screen once again so it will be like this alt enter and alt enter again so now you have uh, 4040 by 1080 and in case if you're running a 120 CFG file or any config like that it won't mess it up and I'll show it to you right here yeah. and to tell how if you have custom res or not your inventory and your whole UI over here would look something like this it will be raised upwards and here uh, I have a 120 CFG running and it's perfectly fine it doesn't uh, get rid of it or anything so now you have custom res right. so that's all for this video another quick note is uh, if you are running the Windows 11 uh, I'm not sure if you can uh, run this uh, if you can do this technique since you guys will not have graphics control panel uh, if you guys don't have it well unlucky I'll try helping uh, I'll try leaving a guide in the description that might help you hopefully it helps you out otherwise I'm sorry but for people who use Windows 10 uh, you can just uh, use Intel control panel and then you're good to go I that's all for this uh, video thank you